Howdy folks, welcome back. So in my last video, I was showing you some images of Jesus captured in the clouds. And I also showed you some images captured in the etherical realm. And uh, I had noticed a crown in the etherical realm. Well, this time, I noticed what looked like a crown right here. But in the clouds this time, not in the etherical realm on the... on. The, the camera it's actually in the clouds now and if you tilt your head to the right you can make out Jesus's face there's his eyes his nose his chin his hair flowing back this way with his crown hovering above his head so I'll let you guys look at that image for a minute and um, it just it just looked like a storm to me and I could see the crown in the clouds, so that's what attracted me to this to the storm, and I started squeezing pictures off. And it wasn't until later that I downloaded them that I noticed them once the image was compressed. These little boxes up above here compress the image. And I'm going to show you what I mean here. We're going to go zoom in. Tilt your head to the right, and you can see the image once it's compressed. And this went on for quite a while. This hung in the sky for a good 15, 20 minutes. And, and uh, hang on here. So as you can see, I squeezed off a lot of pictures of this. So it, it hung in the sky for, for a minute there. And uh, well, I want to take you to this black and white image right here. And then it's a lot clearer. We'll pull this down so you can see it a little bit better. Tilt your head to the right. And in the sky, it looks like this, all blurry. But then once you pull back and look at the bigger picture, tilt your head to the right, you can see Jesus with his crown. Then as this event progressed, I kept snapping pictures there were other events going on in the sky at the same time in different parts of the sky and uh, let's see here we'll go into these other pictures here because there were some other other things that started happening a circle started to form in the sky in front of me and it looked like this right there the entire image is too too blurry, but as we get further in here, as that started to happen, then I went back to the cloud that Jesus was at, and it changed into a lion's face wearing a crown. Can you see the lion's face? His eyes are right here, and his nose, and the crown, so... The Jesus face turned into a lion face. Okay, here's like one of the final images of the lion face where you can really start to make out the eyes, the nose, the mouth, and everything. And then up above here, you can see that was the last photo of the lion face. Then in a different part of the sky... This circular shape started to take shape with two eyes and what looks like a little frown or something. Looks like he's got a couple of horns too or whatever. This looks like a symbol I've seen on an Imagine Dragons video or something like that. And this is a real image, you guys. I didn't make this up. This is just appearing in the sky. There's also pyramids in here I can see. So there's multiple dimension stuff in these pictures. And I'm going to go back up top here, and we're going to scroll a little forward here. Um, in this image, it its nose starts to appear and stuff with the smile now. that the, the frown turns into a smile here. And we'll get to, like, that's the last image I captured where this thing is looking down and smiling. Much like uh, this avatar right there, huh? <laughs> kind of crazy. So there's that. And then I switched back to the lion face, and it had changed a little bit more. So there was a good shot of the lion's face, now even a little broader, looking from a different angle or something. 
and then I went back to whoopsie the wrong way to this and there's a good image of that thing in the sky and there's the final image I took of that before it faded out and then I started taking pictures again back over this way because I saw a round circular object right here and uh, it almost looks like a big giant eye in the sky looking down and I got some other pictures I've taken with an eye in the sky that actually has eyelashes on it and uh, I'll do another video on some other pictures and I got a bunch more coming you guys so hold on I've been capturing stuff every day now I got dragons more images of Jesus in the sky so um, as soon as I get to work through all these these uh, pictures, these new pictures I got, I'll uh, try to start doing a video maybe every day for you guys and keep you updated. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll leave you with this last image right here. This is where I turn the camera sideways a little bit to, to try and capture it a little bit better from the angle that it was at so you don't have to turn your head sideways, but figured I'd bring that to you. Because um, it gives me hope, and hopefully this is bringing all you guys some hope, especially in this uh, time where all this chaos. And So, I love you all. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you real soon with another one. Bye.